Hey guys, this is part two of the Monster Jam unboxings. Um, apparently, as I went to unbox this truck, um, the camera stopped recording because my leg was pressed up against the screen, which stopped recording. And I'm pretty upset about that because uh, I didn't get to unbox this on camera like I, how I needed to. But, I mean, it's still better than nothing. At least I get to show you guys the truck, so... I mean, look at Stinger Unleashed. I mean, this truck is really cool. I mean, on the side, it says Stinger. Give the camera will focus. And it's better if I turn the flash. Um, it says Stinger Unleashed. It's got the Scorpion on the side with the Monster Jam logo. Oh, wait. If you see the flash on, you can see the better sparkle paint on there. And uh, Stinger Unleashed on the hood. This is Wayne's Towing Records or whatever it says. Or Recovery. Oh, wait. Wayne's Towing and Recovery. And Stinger Unleashed right there. 717 wraps. Whatever on the side right there. And I also like the body design on this truck. Wow. It's like a Baja shaped truck. I just didn't think I'd get this. And also a good color combination with the black rims and the grayish silverish roll cage. Well, this is cool. And on with the next item. Hey guys. And... I'm here with the next truck, and it is the Overcast Dragon here, guys. Let's unbox this. Okay. Uh... Okay, well, this time I figure it's gray. Uh, yeah. Same thing here, same routine. But this. Now, let's get to the Overcast Dragon. Now, this is the last Overcast truck I even got tonight. So, this is pretty cool. It's like the same as the original Dragon set. It's just, you know, color's black. Well, much more of a gray color than black. I mean, the black ones are like the Blue Thunder and the Gravedigger Overcast. So, yeah. I mean, this is both, like, a, a little bit of black, but most of it's gray. And the gray rims, I like that. And they put a good combination with the black and the yellow color. Especially with the teeth. And I see the flames coming out. That's a good combination. And except the yellow part, with the black and gray, um, it doesn't even look close to yellow. Looks more like gold, which is pretty cool. Same thing at the top. Nice horns there. And there's some razor sharp uh, things over here. I can't. I don't know if that's supposed to be teeth or if that's something else, but yeah, there's the dragon's nose. And uh, there's the back view of it. Uh, it's the top, the sides, just this dragon and monster jam on it. Well, this is cool. On to the next item. Up next, this is pretty cool, actually. It is Jurassic Attack. Now, let's crack this one open. Okay. I was hoping my video didn't stop. My recording didn't stop. And luckily it did not. So let's just... Unbox this. Okay, Jurassic Attack here. And I've got another light blue figure. Same thing, we got same routine, same these things. Well, let's get with Jurassic Attack. Now it's just basically the same thing, guys. And here is the Mattel version of Jurassic Attack. 
I'm just wanting to show you guys the color treads one because that's the one I have right now. Um, yeah, so. Yeah, I mean, one thing that's missing actually is this red part, these red stripes on here. I don't know if it's showing the sign of where the dinosaur got cut or sliced or whatever. But when it's showing it on the Mattel one, it's not showing it like in rows. It just it's just going in zigzags and like in in an uneven direction. And the color of them is black, not red to look more realistic. And the horns look more realistic. These ones they look like they're just I don't know how you're supposed to describe it or not, but yeah. I mean the back horn or whatever it is back here. It's like a little smaller and longer like how it's supposed to be. Over here it's like like more bigger and like shorter. Like on the sides, not too long at all. I mean, that's one thing that, you know, the back looks more realistic, you know, with how it's supposed to be. Mattel it just made it, like, much more bigger and much more, like, wider. Like, well, I mean, the, like, it made it much more, like, taller than how it's supposed to look. So, the Spin Masters are making all the trucks look more realistic than whatever Mattel, compared to whatever Mattel tried to do. Mattel mostly, like, messed up with, like, you know, how they were making their trucks. Not that, not that I'm, um, I'm not saying that I don't like any of the trucks made by Mattel. They're still pretty cool. It's that they just didn't get the tool shape right. Um, but however, Spin Master is getting it right. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. On with the next item. This is the last single pack. And it is the Inverse Higher Education. Oh, yeah. Let's get it cracked open. Okay. Okay. Now I got a yellow figure. The same thing here. Now let's take a look at the inverse higher education. Now this is pretty cool. I mean, I'm sure the reason why they call these the inverse ones is that because the tire color is like black. And higher education's color is yellow, so they kind of, you know, mixed it up and made it backwards. That's what they, that's probably what they mean by inverse. So they put the, the body color on the wheels, and they put the tire color on the truck. Which is really cool, because I really like the combination with this. Especially with the yellow color, so instead of the body being black and the words on here being, I mean, yellow, I mean, wait. Instead of the body being yellow and the words on here being black, um, the body's black and the words are yellow. The Monster Jam symbol on there says Cool Bus at the back. Okay, I don't know how, why it looks like that, why the bus word on there, like, is smeared right there. But Cool Bus is, like, right over here. The stop sign right there. Except the sign is white and the... Word stop is red when the sign should be red and stop should be white. Which, yeah, which is basically why this is an inverse truck. But, at the same time, you know it's awesome. I like this. Alright, next item. Next up, I have a versus pack here. The versus pack is Ice Cream Man and Monster Mutt. Let's crack these bad boys open. Okay, so here is Ice Cream Man, and here is Monster Mutt. I believe in here there's a problems and questions card. I leave, I leave that in there. Put the pack key right there. Oh, come on. Okay, so here we'll start off with Ice Cream Man. So, Ice Cream Man is really cool. I like all the ice cream that's right there, and some of it looks like it's splashed on there on onto the truck. Um, 
and everything. And then it says Ice Cream Man. There's a stop sign right there. I don't know why it's not 3D, but whatever. It says Caution Children right there. It says it on the sides there and on the front. That's what it says on the front. Same thing right over there. It says Ice Cream Man and all the ice cream stuff on there. And then it says Ice Cream Man on the top. With all the ice cream splashed on there. like the color combinations with white and blue. And especially with the body that's white. And the blue roll cage in the blue rim. Sorry, my phone just dropped. But, yeah. And also the combination with the black tires as well. This is really cool. Okay. On with Monster Mode Dalmatian. Now, this is really cool because I like the uh, color of the truck. And also, like, the color of the... Uh, like the beige color of the roll cage. And at the same time, it's got a good color combination with the metallic red rims. I mean... Yeah, it says Monster Mutt on the side. Monster, Monster Jam logo there. Monster Mutt on the leash, or the collar, whatever. And it says there's Monster Mutt in the Monster Jam logo. Yeah, that's it for Monster Mutt there. Not much wording on here, but... Yeah, on to the next item. Okay, here we are with the next one. Okay, so you guys might think it is a Fire and Ice set. Um, a Fire and Ice double pack. Because you see Fire Max D and Fire... Uh, no, Ice Monster Mutt Dalmatian. Well, if you're guessing that it is a Fire and Ice pack, then... You are correct, because I got Fire Megalodon and Ice Dragon. Here we go. Let's get this cracked open. Oh, jeez. Come on. Oh, come on. Damn phone. Alright, anyway, sorry for the language. Okay, I'm assuming there's another problems and questions card in here. Oh, oh, there's not. Oh, yeah, there is. So I'm gonna leave that there. Let's continue with the fire and ice truck. So. First off, we'll get to Fire Megalodon. Now, this one is really cool. I mean, I really like this truck. I mean, I mean the entire body, like most of the body color is like gray and like the hood part is like white. I mean, yeah, and then it's showing flames over here on the side it says Monster Jam Fire. And then uh Wait a minute, I think it's showing a guy that's sitting in there. But anyways, yeah, there's the eyes right there. Got fire-colored eyes. Good combination with the color orange, yellow, and red. Because the interior part, it's red with the yellow roll cage. And you got orange tires, yellow treads, and red rims. I like the color combination. It just says Megalodon and Monster Jam Fire. So, yeah, that's it for him. Let's get on with the Ice Dragon. So, same thing as the Overcast Dragon right there. So it's just ice color. Nice combinations with blue and white. And the gray color for horn for the horns on there. I mean, yeah. nice with the blue interior. Um, white roll cage. White treads. Crystal clear blue tires and blue rims. I mean, I like this truck. Okay, on to the next item. That truck's pretty cool. Okay, now, here we are with the next versus pack. It is the Nitro Neons Max D and the Nitro Neons Alien Invasion. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, boy. Let's 
get this thing cracked open. Oh wait, this one was easy. The other problems and questions card. Okay, so with the Nitro Neons Max D. Now this one is nice. It's got literally the yellow roll cage with the Nitro Neons yellow colored tires and black rims. This is a pretty good color combination. Then you got the regular body there, Max D. Ten time Monster Jam champion or whatever. Or 11-time Monster Jam Champion. What, whatever it is. Um, yeah. Same as always with the truck, you know. With its original body. The nice color combinations. This is cool. This is awesome. That I have this truck here. And next, we have the Nitro Neon's Alien Invasion. Now, I like the green color of the, uh, window here. That nice little silver thing right there. Uh, yeah. It's pretty cool. You got that green light right there. Anyway, you got Alien Invasion here. Nice front. Right there. Nice front view of the truck. Nice back view of the truck. Top view. And also another cool thing about it is that you got the green roll cage. Silver interior. And you got the green Nitro Neon color tires. And you got the black color rims. I mean, I like this. Same thing with the Nitro Neons Max D with the yellow roll cage and the yellow tires. So, those two trucks are cool. And on with our last item. Okay, here we are with our last item. The last versus pack here. So, it is another Nitro Neons pack. Nitro Neons Blue Thunder and Nitro Neons Hurricane Force. Oh, yeah. Let's get it there. This one... Well, this one is easy, man. This one is easy. You know, one thing, actually, it's that... I found Hurricane Force and Blue Thunder, um, the Nitro Neons ones, in the J Walmart in Joliet, but I never got a chance to get that. No problems and questions, card. But... I did find one in Morris, Illinois. The Walmart in Morris, Illinois. So, here we are starting with Blue Thunder. You know, regular body as usual. But well, hold on. Yeah, get the light blue color of the Nitro Neons. You got black rims. And you got the yellow, I mean, not yellow. Blue roll cage. You got blue thunder here on the Is sides here. The back. Was, uh, the top. Um, you got blue thunder on the hood. This one? Same as always. Now on to the next truck. Okay, guys. Now on with the last truck. We have the Nitro Neons Hurricane Force. Red Nitro Neons colored tires. With the red roll cage. And the s chrome silver interior here because let's see you got hurricane force monster jam there nothing on the back good color combinations here i see you got flames on the hoods with the purple and white color hurricane force and monster jam right there a nice rainbow color right over here on the side for the hurricanes uh nice red and orange combination yeah so this is pretty cool anyway that was my entire haul for my Monster Jam unboxing. It's really cool. But anyway, um, with the trucks that I had with uh, the Overcast Blue Thunder, Dragonoid, Grey Digger the Legend, Nomad Avenger, Stinger, Overcast Dragon, Jurassic Attack, and the Inverse Higher Education, the only truck that I'm missing out of that case is the training trucks, Grave Digger. Now, I don't have any of the training trucks. I wish I would have seen the training trucks, Grave Digger, there. You know, if it was there, I would have taken it, most definitely. Well, anyway, that's the end of the unboxing video. I'll see you next time. Peace.